Science 2, Force and Motion. Objectives. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to define force and motion. Describe motion and what force can do. Identify the forces that can move objects. Tell whether an object has moved or not through a reference point. What are the kids doing in the picture? One kid is pushing a wooden box. Another is kicking a ball. Another is pulling a cart. Another is pushing on a scooter. The kids are causing those things to move or be in motion. Motion is a change in the position or direction of an object or a person. We can say that an object or person has moved when it changed position in relation to a reference point. A referenced point is anything that we can use to tell the change in position or direction of an object. Living things can move by themselves to do work and go from one place to another. Non-living things can't move by themselves. They need force in order to move. Force is the push or pull exerted on an object. A push or a pull can cause objects to move. Force from pushing and pulling. Pushing and pulling are two actions that make an object move or change its position. They can stop an object from moving as well. Pushing makes an object move away from you. For example, when you push a table or chair, you make it move away from you. When you push a baby stroller, you make it move forward. Pulling makes an object move toward you. An example of this is when you pull a string with a toy car, you make it move toward you. Another example is when you need to pull a weed from the soil, you have to tug it and move it toward you. You have to use a certain amount of force to make things move. If you want to move or lift a big and heavy object, you need to apply more force. If you want to move or lift a light object, you do not need to use so much force. Now, let's talk about the other forces that make things move and work. Force from electricity. Electricity is a kind of force or energy that builds up in one place before flowing out to another. It provides electrical force that is used to run appliances like washing machines, blenders, and vacuum cleaners. Electricity comes from other sources like batteries and power plants. A battery is an object that stores energy and makes this available as electricity. Batteries come in different sizes and shapes. They can be small and circular, and they can also be big and rectangular in shape such as the batteries used in cars. A power plant is a building that has big generators. A generator is a machine that turns other kinds of energy into electricity. Force from gravity. What goes up must come down. This saying refers to the force that pulls everything downward to Earth. Earth exerts a force on objects. Gravitational force or gravity pulls objects toward the ground. Gravity pulls fruits from a tree to fall to the ground. A ball tossed upward comes down. All these happen because of the force of gravity. Force from magnets. A magnet is a piece of iron that attracts or pulls things to itself. It has magnetic force. It attracts some metals. Materials that are made of iron or steel are attracted to magnets and are called magnetic materials. Examples of these are nails, pins, and paper clips. However, not all metals are attracted to magnets. Examples of such materials are aluminum pans, gold earrings, and silver bracelets. Force from wind. 
Wind is moving air. It blows leaves and light objects like paper. A sailboat moves when moving air pushes on its sail. The wind also makes kites fly in the air. It can also move the leaves of trees. Wind moves objects. Force from moving water. Running or flowing water is a force that makes objects move. It moves paper boats, dried leaves, logs, small rocks in the river, and other objects from one place to another. Practice exercise. Choose the correct answer in each question. 1. What makes the electric fan, rice cooker, and washing machine work? A. Magnet. B. Gravity. C. Water. D. Electricity. D. Electricity. 2. Which can be moved by a magnet? A. Paper clip. B. Paper. C. Match stick. D. Rubber band. A. Paper clip. 3. What force pulls objects toward the ground? A. Magnet. B. Water. C. Electricity. D. Gravity. D. Gravity. 4. What force can attract objects made of some metals? A. Electricity. B. Wind. C. Water. D. Magnetic force. D. Magnetic force. 5. Which shows movement in an object? A. Its shape changed. B. Its size changed. C. Its color changed. D. Its position changed. D. Its position changed. 